What's up guys, welcome back. So iOS 14.2 developer beta 2 is now out. It came out today and if you are a public beta tester, expect it either later on today or the following day. For me on my iPhone 6s, as you can see here, it came in as a small size. It's around 515.6 megabytes. And if you have a higher end device, be aware that this update could be as big as four gig as different users are seeing different sizes. And for me, I'm actually updating from beta one to 14.2 beta two. And if you go into the settings just to see, you know, the software changes that came with this update you can see the new software version that we now have an e at the end and if we see the modern firmware version that we have here we now have 8.02.00 and then if we go back just to see how much this update is taking on iphone storage there it just takes a moment to load and if you scroll all the way down you see the system has increased it's taking 7.31 gig so that's the software changes now in terms of new features that came with this update the first one has to do with a bunch of new emojis that came with this update so as you can see here you have a ton ton new emojis that came with ios 14.2 beta 2 and this has to do with the emoji 13 update that was just released by apple also with this update there's a wording change that seems to suggest that the new iphone 12 won't have earphones or headphones with the box so that is another change that came with this update the wording has been updated to reflect some rf exposure audio unlike the previous version where it absolutely mention the earphone also if we go to our control center here and do this to the music icon if you use the apple music icon you notice that you know it has been updated to a newer version so this is a change that you are going to see and this icon is now bigger and when you uh, have an image here it's now showing different albums and also tracks so that is another change that came with this update if we go to the health app you can see that you know we now have a new splash screen here so if you're opening the health app for the first time on ios 14.2 the first time this is what you are going to see and basically those are the new features and changes when it comes to battery performance so far I've been using it for like about two hours and I can't complain so far my device is on 50 3% I updated when it was on 75 so it's not too bad if we go to see the battery health you can see that it's still on 88 on 80% 80 actually before that it was on 80% and if we see you know the battery usage over the course of time you can see that you know I haven't been using it much but after about two to three days I will be able to do a follow-up video where I illustrate this properly and if we go to see the Geekbench scores that I had here and if we see like the C CPU performance. This is what I have on 14.2 beta 2 and this is what I had on 14.2 beta 1. So not much of a change when it comes to CPU performance. If you go to GPU performance that is responsible for 3D image rendering, you can see the score that I have here on 14.2 beta 2 and this is the score that I had on 14.2 beta 1. So in terms of GPU performance it has actually dropped. I don't know why. Perhaps if I was to run Kick bench again i would get different scores now when it comes to whether you should update or not i believe that if you are on ios 14 the official version there's no need to get on the beta yet as the changes that came with this update are very minor and also actually with this update if you have the apple watch series 6 like i do here you now find that blood oxygen testing is now possible on 14.2 beta 1 you could not do blood oxygen testing so with 14.2 beta 2 that has been fixed so basically that's about it for me when it comes to the next uh, update or perhaps ios 14.1 we can expect it you know around the release of the newer iphones now at this time it's been said that the newer iphones are going to be released on october the 13th which is around here so you know expect ios 14.1 to ship with the newer iphones when they come out and that's about it for me guys if you like the video drop a like and hit subscribe and thank you very much for watching stay safe and i will definitely see you in the next video peace